If you have cats in your family, you'll have kitty litters parked up around your house. And it's not so much a matter of do you have them, it's how many you have and whether you have enough. And that's what we're going to cover off in today's video. I'm Romy Bueller, Animal Communicator. Thanks for joining me today, everyone. I've had many, many clients across the globe, cat clients that is, tell me that their kitty litter stinks. And hands up for being a bad mother, that would be me because I've been told the same thing by one of my cats in an interview that I did with her some years ago. So the general rule of thumb is one tray per cat plus one. And I say general because you know each household is different, cats interact differently, but they are generally very clean and they like their own trays. Now, I had a cat that had kidney cancer. He drank a lot because he couldn't satiate his thirst, so he peed a lot. And the thing with that is I had four trays for two cats because I was constantly cleaning them. And he didn't want to be going in a tray that he'd already peed in, more than once actually, uh, which is what he told me. So keep that in mind. I work from home most of the time, so I can clean them quite often. But if I'm out and about, I have one cat now, and I'll leave her three trays. If I'm home, I'll leave her two trays. She's an outdoor cat for whatever reason, she likes to wee and poo inside. But what she does, and what yours may do too, is if they're not clean, because even though they smell clean to me, they're not clean to her, if they're not clean, she'll wee next to it. And it runs all underneath and all over the floor, and it's like, oh, okay, got it, got your picture. Uh, the other thing that you may find is, if your cat's not weeing or pooing inside the kitty litter and they're just dropping their business on your favourite Persian, is they may not like the feel of the kitty litter underfoot. I hear that often too. So play around with your kitty litter. See how you go. Thanks for joining me today, everyone. If you'd like to read my full interview with Rizzy, I'll drop the blog link above so you can go straight there and check it out. I'm Romy Bueller, animal communicator talking to animals because they can't always help themselves.